This video was sponsored by Brilliant. And to Miss Alara Vance, a sum I am certain will be adequate. Hundred million dollars. One hundred million. A staggering sum for a young woman who swore she'd never met the benefactor. Okay, so today uh, I just wanted to show you kind of a super cool workflow I've been playing around with this weekend using Gemini 2.5 Pro and the new Google VO3 model. So I think we're just gonna dive straight in and I'm gonna show you kind of how I set up this workflow. Because if you look at the Google 2.5 Pro, we have something called, uh, we can do upload file and we can do YouTube videos too. But uh, I'm gonna show you kind of how I have played around with this and I gotta say the results look pretty good. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, so uh, what we wanna start on is uh, of course go to Gemini 2.5 Pro. Uh, but uh, I'm gonna show you, I have kind of this template prompt I've been using. So this is kind of my template for cinematic scene prompts. Uh, so we have some camera specs, character names, and kind of the shot setup, audio, key elements. And this has been working pretty good. So how we kind of use this template now is we go to, yeah, uh, Google 2.5 here on AI Studio. We just drop the template in here, and that's a good start, right? Uh, but we also want an ID for our uh, short film, right? So I went to Claude, I just say, uh, brainstorm five intriguing short thriller ideas involving like a stunning girl in her early 20s, saying, okay, okay, crying it was me, me, it was me, I did it. Cliffhanger mystery, billionaire mansion, palace intrigue. Yeah, you can just do any type of prompt here because you just want some ideas. If you have a good idea yourself, you can just, yeah, do it yourself. Okay, we get some responses here. Here is like the inheritance game. So let's choose this as our idea, right? A young woman attends a billionaire's will reading this gothic countryside palace. She's a mysterious name as a beneficiary despite never meeting him. Yeah, you can read this if you want to. So we're just gonna grab this idea for our short film. So this is just gonna show you how this works. Uh, we can go back here. And now I'm gonna do a second prompt. I'm just gonna do like an ID here and I'm gonna do, so from the idea above, create the first eight second scene of the short film, uh, thriller film. Give a detailed description of the protagonist since, since we need to generate her in multiple scenes. Write scene one using our template. Okay, so we can run this now. And hopefully now we're gonna get this into like a structured template that we can run here on Flow. So let's just start a new project here. And we're gonna choose uh, uh, VO3. Uh, we're just gonna do one output. And when we have the prompt, I'm gonna send it in here. Okay, so you can see now we have kind of our first scene here. Uh, we have some specs for the camera, Aria Alexa Mini LF, okay. Uh, here we have the description of our protagonist. That's gonna be Elara, 24 years old, hazel eyes. So here is kind of, we get the description since we're gonna, yeah, use her in multiple scenes and we just get like a scene description. So what we're gonna do now is just grab this prompt and send it. Okay, so let's over to flow, paste this in, right? Yeah, this looks good. Okay, so uh, next is gonna be kind of the interesting part, how we can actually use uh, uh, Google Trip 2.5 here. Okay, so we have kind of our first scene here, so let's just watch it. Right, just. Find a seat. Right, just. Find a seat. Okay, that was not too bad. It was a bit strange, but we're just gonna go with it. Uh, I really enjoy the audio. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna download this. Just original size, right? So we have the video here. And then we're gonna go back to, uh, yeah, Gemini. And what we're gonna do now is we're gonna upload a file. So what is cool about Gemini is that we can kind of analyze the video we just did, right? So uh, let me come up with a new prompt here. So we're just gonna try analyze the scene one video, then evolve the story and write scene two for our short film trailer. And let's run that. So what's gonna happen now is that Gemini is gonna kind of look at each image of the video and try to get an overview of what happened in the first scene. And from that, it's gonna write the second scene, right? So let's just wait for the second prompt here and then we can go back to flow and run that again. And we're just gonna continue like that and we're gonna see if we end up with something that is quite coherent.
Okay, so now you can see, let's evolve the story and write scene two, story evolution, uh, just enter the room, uh, we know that. The wheel reading is now begin, a crucial part is being delivered. Okay, so now we're just gonna grab scene two, okay? Go back to flow, new scene. So we're not gonna use kind of the extend features on anything because they are not working that good yet. But let's try to do this text to video like creating our own scenes, using, own scenes using Gemini here and see how it turns out. Then we're gonna put everything together at the end. Before we look at scene two, let's check out today's sponsor, brilliant.org. Do you want to know how AI like ChatGPT actually functions? Today's sponsor, Brilliant.org, has an amazing course called How AI Works. The course guides you through step by step, starting with the basics, how AI predicts text by analyzing patterns in like massive amounts of data. You then quickly move on to more advanced concepts like uh, language model training, learning how models improve through each training phase by cleaning, processing, and tokenizing text. What kind of set Brilliant apart is kind of their interactive learning. Instead of just passively watching videos, you're actively engaging with lessons that make like complex AI concepts intuitive and actually quite fun. Plus you build these timeless uh, problem solving skills that you can apply basically anywhere, uh, whether you're coding, designing circuit, or you're just analyzing some data. So if you're curious about AI and you want to kind of sharpen your thinking skills at the same time, Brilliant is perfect for you. So visit brilliant.org slash allaboutai or just scan the QR code. You will then get a 30 day free trial. But you'll also get 20% off a premium annual subscription. So a big thanks to Brilliant for sponsoring this video. Now let's go back to the project. Okay, so we have scene two here now. So let's take a look at it. And to Miss Alara Vance, a sum I am certain will be adequate. Hundred million dollars in it. And to Miss Alara Vance, a sum I am certain will be adequate, hundred million dollars. Okay, so I guess we have something here. Uh, it's not perfect, but let's move on. Let's create a few more scenes using the same technique. We're gonna download this video. We're gonna put it in, analyze it, write scene three. So I'm just gonna skip ahead, do a few more scenes, and then we can watch those. And yeah, that is what I did. So you can see here now we have uh, this is scene two, we analyzed that, we uh, created scene three, then we took scene three, fed it in here, analyzed that, and I just continued down here until I think we had about eight different scenes. Yeah, I think we ended up with this, and this was the final one, this was the outro. So we ended up with about one minute of video. I did a few retakes because we had some issues here creating some of the scenes, like this I had to do twice, I did this twice I think, and I just picked the one I like the most. But now we have this trailer, and I think it turned out pretty good. I went to Suno and I added some background dramatic trailer music. So I think we're just gonna watch the full clip now, in like uh, from beginning till end. Do a bit of a recap, then I'm gonna show you a different style of prompts you can use in VO if you wanna try that out. So yeah, let's watch the full thing now from start to finish. Right, just... Find a seat. And to Miss Alara Vance, a sum I am certain will be adequate. Hundred million dollars. One hundred million. A staggering sum for a young woman who swore she'd never met the benefactor, Alistair Blackwood. But the threads of fate binding Elara to Blackwood Manor were far more tangled and far older than a simple line in a will. In the shadow of Blackwood, the deadliest secrets are those you inherit, and the game has only just begun. The Inheritance Game. Okay, that was pretty cool, right? Uh, I'm pretty happy with that. So this was basically only made by using kind of our tactic by doing one scene, uploading it, doing the second scene as I showed you. So I would say the result turned out pretty good, but adding that music really brought it to life if you ask me. So uh, I just uploaded this to YouTube here because uh, it's so hard to show on Mac. So I'm gonna leave the link in the description if you wanna watch it again. 
so that is pretty cool. Uh, let me show you the template once again uh, because I think some I think we can do some more work with the template here to get it even more consistent. Uh, but uh, I'm really now just waiting for Google to kind of fix the. They have some issues around this when we do this scene builders, right? Not maybe this one, but we do scene builders and we can't really extend by using the newest model. So when that gets going, I think it's going to be really interesting if you ask me. So looking forward to that. Because if we add this to scene now, you can't see when we do extend and jump to, we can't really use uh, VO3. So that kind of ruins this part. Uh, but using this, uh, the way we did it now, worked out pretty good. And I think it was fairly consistent overall, the trailer we created. Uh, at the end here, I just want to show you one more thing that is pretty cool that you can do using uh, VO3. So one thing you can do is you can create this kind of, I don't know what you call it, this mood boards or idea boards. So here I can come and have uh, Mount Everest, Himalaya, I have some explosions pointing at a skier. So uh, if we put this into VO3 now, I'm gonna show you how it turned out. So you can see the first frame is exactly what I uploaded. Uh, but let's play this now. So you can see the skier is kind of in this uh, avalanche explosion. We have Mount Everest in the background. So it's pretty cool. So I'm gonna keep exploring with the new VO3 model, try different input prompts, try different uh, yeah, ways to do this by using maybe other LLMs. Uh, and when we kind of get uh, fixed this uh, flow work UI here, it's a bit strange. I saw other creators cover that too. Uh, we're gonna do more VO3. Uh, but so far it's been a blast and I had a lot of fun playing around with this. Definitely go check it out, but it's a bit expensive. I think you have some free shots on Gemini maybe if you are on the pro plan, I'm not quite sure, but uh, yeah, uh, I recommend it if you want to try it out like at the best video models, but like I said, it's a bit expensive to run. Uh, but yeah, hope you enjoyed this one and hope you tune back when you have some more VO3. Enjoy your day and we speak soon. And don't forget to check out brilliant.org in the description. We speak soon.